Today's topic is about what does it take to make you happy or what does it take to be happy? Excuse me, a lot of times we find ourselves chasing after the, the things that make us happy. What is going to make us happy, especially when we feel sad, disconnected, lonely, you know, the, the disappointed in this world or that we live in or our families or our friends or ourselves. And we seek for things outside of ourselves to make us happy, right? People, places, events, material things, consumption, 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 food, alcohol, drugs. We associate happiness, right? This goal to be happy with these feelings of elation and excitement and, you know, some engagement. And these things honestly are temporary. If we want to have true, lasting happiness, we need to find contentment. Contentment comes from an inner state of being. In the Sufi teachings, contentment is a high station. It's considered a high station. It's learning to be content with what life brings, whether it's the highs, the lows, the mundane, or you know anything in between. When we are seeking more and more and more in an attempt to find happiness, this is, I mean, this is what has driven addiction. It's what's driven our world into this cycle of consumption and waste, consume more, waste more, consume more, waste more. And it is what depletes our Earth's resources. It clutters our homes, it clutters our hearts, makes us less healthy in our bodies, and makes us less happy. So today, God willing, we will dive in the journey to the center of yourself to release ourselves from this roller coaster of discontent, right? Because the highs get higher, the lows get lower, and ultimately we're more and more discontent because we can't keep seeking, seeking, seeking forever and depleting, 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 watching our earth turn into this like, oh my gosh, is it going to, to um, survive? Is it going to survive? And if it doesn't survive, we don't survive. And so, you know, what's, it's just creating more and more, um, honestly, like social injustice, environmental injustice, everything else on our planet. Well, we're all kind of perpetuating the cycle. The more that we buy into the consumption and the waste and the consumption and the waste, we perpetuate the cycle, which is depleting our earth and causing the, the, um, the circumstances, the situation, the living conditions, conditions the word I'm looking for, to be more difficult for all of us. So what we want to look at is what do we need to release ourselves from the roller coaster of ultimate discontent? And what can we simplify in order to find contentment and live a more har harmonious life? So that is our topic for today. Let's go ahead and come into our meditation and healing circle.